Hello everyone, this is Talal Hussain. Hope all of you are doing well. Today we are going to talk about how should we determine a good SAT score. Now, you know, a good SAT score, there is no really, you know, there is a good SAT score. There is a very famous narrative out there. People are discussing, students are talking about this. How many, how much score, you know, would be good for me? Uh, what is that target score that, you know, should I should get? So there is no perfect score. There is no uh, predetermined score that, you know, you should get that we can call a good SAT score. I cannot tell you that 1400 is a good SAT score, 1500 is a good SAT score or 1300 is a good ACT score because I do not know frankly uh, which university or college you are applying for. That is very important. So just remember the fact that you know whenever you discuss what is a good SAT score, a good SAT score is a score that can get you into your college or your desired college or university, right? So whenever we talk about a good SAT score, what we need to look at, the first thing that we need to look at is the university that we are applying for, right? So you know there may there may be a student you know uh, who is going to a university that is uh, giving admissions on 1300. So for him, 1300 is a very good score, right? And again, there can be a student uh, who wants to go to a university that is giving admissions on 1500. So for that student, 1450 or even 1490 would be a bad score, you know, because he needs a 1500. So you know there is no fixed score for any student. It depends on the university. Uh, that you're applying for that's a repetition but yes if you want to determine the good score what is your good score you have to see the colleges you are applying for and you have to see you know what is the highest score that you need to get into those colleges right so for example if you are applying into five colleges and the college that is asking for the highest score uh, is for example 1450 so your good score for the SAT will be 1450 you have to work for that you have to target that or maybe you know target a few 20 30 or more points you know then you know what your actual good score is so that you know you can uh, land on the score that you really want and once you know the college that you are applying for and the score that you want you can start your preparation according to that score prepare according to that work on your weaknesses get that high score and you know get in the university that you want so just don't get into this debate don't just think about uh, you know any random score right uh, plan properly look at the university you want to get into and then you know target the score and work for it and you know maybe get into your university your desired university so all the best all of you thank you so much